Welcome everybody to day five of our 21 day Daniel fast. I'll be reading Psalms 40. It says here, I waited patiently for the Lord and he inclined to me I heard and heard my cry. He also brought me up out of a horrible pit, out of the miry clay and set my feet upon a rock and established my steps. He has put a new song in my mouth. Praise to our God. Many will see it and fear and will trust in the Lord. Blessed is the man who makes the Lord his trust and does not respect the proud nor such as turn aside to lies. Many, O Lord my God, are your wonderful works which you have done. And your thoughts towards us cannot be recounted to you in order. If I would declare and speak of them, they are more than can be numbered. Sacrifice and offering you did not desire. My ears you have opened. Burnt offering and sin offering you did not require. Then I said, behold, I come and the scroll of the book. It is written of me. I delight to do your will, O my God, and your law is within my heart. I have proclaimed the good news of righteousness and in the great assembly. Indeed, I do not restrain my lips. O Lord, you yourself know. I have not hidden your righteousness within my heart. I have declared your faithfulness and your salvation. I have not concealed your loving kindness and your truth from the great assembly. Do not withhold your tender mercies from me, O Lord. Let your loving kindness and your truth continually preserve me. For innumerable evils have surrounded me. My iniquities have overtaken me so that I am not able to look up. They are more than the hairs of my head. Therefore, my heart fails me. Be pleased, O Lord, to deliver me. O Lord, make haste to help me. Let them be ashamed and brought to mutual confusion who seek to destroy my life. Let them be driven backward and brought to dishonor who wish evil. Let them be confused because of their shame who say to me, aha, aha. Let all those who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. Let such love and your salvation say continually, let the Lord be magnified, but I am poor and needy. Yet the Lord thinks upon me. You are my help and my deliverer. Do not delay, oh my God. I pray that encouraged you. I just want to encourage you real quick. You might be feeling like giving up. I know it's day five, and you might say, man, I, I don't know if I could finish this fast. I know a lot of us have different reasons why we fast and, and what we want to see God do during this fast. And I know my number one reason is to get closer to God. I know this year I want to see more of God. I want more, I want more of God, whatever he has for me. I want to know what it is. And that's one of the reasons why I fast. But I also have another reason. And my reason is this. I have a family. I have a wife. I want to be a better husband. I want to be a better father to my kids. I want to see my kids saved. I want to see my kids healed. I want to see my kids delivered. And maybe you can relate to that same, same reason. Maybe you have different reasons. I want to encourage you. Don't give up. Don't give up. Maybe you messed up on your fast and it's okay. I encourage you, get back on it and continue to persevere through it. And I guarantee you, you're going to see God move in ways you've never seen before. If you just continue, don't let yourself feel condemned. But continue in the fast. For whatever reason you have for fasting, just continue to believe God for the impossible. Let's pray. Father, we just come before you today, God. God, I pray for all those fasting right now, God. I pray for strength, God. I pray for supernatural strength, God, that they will continue, God, in the fast, God, for whatever reasons they have, God, whatever you have placed on their hearts, God, God, that they will not grow, grow weary, God, that they will not give up, God, that they will continue to fight through, God. God, we thank you, God, for strengthening us, God, during this fast. We thank you for the things that you're going to do, God. We thank you for the doors that you're going to open, God. We thank you, God, for this year, God, and we just believe, God, for greater things, God, for our lives, God, for our church, God, for our brothers and sisters, God. We thank you right now for all that you've done, God. We give you glory. We give you honor. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you guys, and ha have a good rest of your fast. God bless.